so uh, my name is Hattori Nakamura from the University of Tokyo. And today I'd like to talk about uh, the Japanese history, uh, target the star, starized signature. So uh, first uh, I want to introduce a uh, starized signature we call Kao in Japanese. So a uh, starized signature is uh, uh, used in East Asian cultures. And today we don't use uh, this kind of uh, sign, uh, it's less common, but uh, in the past, uh, individuals uh, used this kind of uh, marks for official documents as a form of authentication and also identification of creators. And so uh, signatures are classified based on a location. Uh, so uh, there is some uh, classes. So this part, the light margin, the signature on the right margin, uh, we call sode. And also, uh, there is a body text, and also here is date. And the signature, bottom of date, is we call uh, nikka. It means the uh, bottom of date. And also, uh, we have okue and okushita kao uh, signatures, which means uh, these uh, signatures are located on the back of documents. And, uh, the sode signatures is most uh, dignified form, and also for against uh, addresses. And also, uh, the okue or okushita, the back uh, signatures, uh, modest form uh, of the signature. So uh, dignified sode and also uh, nikka signatures are more dignified than the uh, okue and okushita kao. So uh, this is an uh, example of uh, these signatures. So here is a uh, date. Uh, there are two documents, and the red part is signatures, and the blue part is date. So uh, this one is uh, we call sode, uh, the light margin of uh, the kao, which located on large ma uh, light margin. And also this one is uh, kao, which located bottom of date. So uh, we have a lot of uh, research against uh, uh, these sterilized signatures. And uh, this is very important for the analyze the status of the people's relationship. But the problem is uh, we have a lot of research, but also uh, but not enough uh, quantitative data is not uh, presented for now. So uh, this research focus on the quantitative uh, analysis uh, against these kind, the location of signatures. So uh, in this study, uh, we use uh, the data from uh, the Historiographical Institute uh, from the University of Tokyo, which is, I belong to uh, the institute. First, uh, I'd like to show you, uh, uh, introduce uh, this institute. Uh, so uh, this institute is a research uh, institute for the Japanese research, uh, Japanese history. Uh, which we target uh, 8th century to the 19th century. So uh, we have a lot of uh, databases. Also, uh, we publish uh, many uh, image, digital image facsimiles uh, for the Japanese history. So uh, this institute is one of the largest research institutes in, for Japanese history in Japan. And so uh, this institute published um, uh, many uh, uh, sterilized signatures. So uh, by using this database, uh, in this study, we use uh, 400 documents, uh, which uh, span from uh, 18th, uh, 11th century to 16th century. And so this one is our original document, and uh, we annotated the date part, uh, signature part, and also uh, the document area. So uh, by using uh, those data, uh, we conducted content uh, analysis, and we use uh, the NVDEV, uh, which is uh, the tool for the writing code and also uh, publish uh, technical articles with uh, the Jupyter notebook. So uh, we are publishing this kind of research analysis, such as chronological analysis, and also uh, some of the uh, analysis based on uh, uh, 
creators. So <clears throat> I don't have enough time to talk about all of uh, these results. So just I want to show you the one example. So uh, this figure shows the average ratio of and also standard deviation for the size of, size of signatures against the, or, uh, the paper uh, by their positions. Position means uh, I introduced uh, before the sode kao, nikka kao, and also the other part. So again, uh, sode is the most uh, dignified one, and also okue and okushita is the most modest one, a more modest one. So uh, this figure showed uh, the <coughs> there is no big difference between the size of uh, signatures uh, between Sode and Nikka, and also uh, Okue and Okushita signatures are more uh, smaller than uh, this uh, Sode and Nikka Kao. And the interesting difference between Sode and Nikka is uh, standard deviation. Uh, Sode uh, has more smaller de devia standard deviation than the Nikka Kao. Uh, this means uh, Sode uh, Kao is uh, we have the sodekao, um, most sodekao is a uh, big one, but the nikkakao, we have smaller one and also big one. So uh, this is also support existing uh, findings that uh, the sodekao is used mainly by the people of high status one, but also uh, on the other hand, the nikkakao, which is uh, the signature bottom of the date is used regardless of sta status uh, to show their uh, authorities. So we conducted this kind of uh, quantitative analysis. Also, for the future work, we are developing a machine learning model. Uh, this shows uh, for the more large amount of data. So uh, we are building the uh, machine learning model. Uh, this shows ex especially the object detection model uh, with YOLO. So this is uh, it's kind of not, uh, not the newest one, but uh, uh, for example, if we approach uh, the document, uh, this model extracts the signatures part and also uh, the date part, and also, again, uh, the document part. Uh, and also, <clears throat> like that, uh, we can get the uh, date part, cow, uh, signatures part, and uh, uh, the area of document. So by using this kind of data, we can uh, expand this uh, research for more uh, big amount of data. So uh, this is a uh, conc oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry, so, uh, in this study, uh, we attempt a quanti quantitative analysis against uh, sterilized signatures. So uh, we can get the, this uh, result that supports existing uh, research based on Japanese history. So uh, in addition, we are developing uh, some machine learning model for the more big size of data. So uh, this is the end of my presentation. Thank you for your attention.